Okay, this is uh, 9 10 2011 uh, Saturday. It's about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, and I'm going to uh, call my wife on my cell phone. And she's going to turn the switch on to the sump pump in the crawl space in the house. So the water, I haven't run that switch for two days. I usually run it once a day, but I haven't run it for a couple of days. And uh, of course the air is not as hot. So it's probably not condensating as much, but I've got a uh, dehumidifier in the crawl space. And I'm going to see how much water will come out this hose. I'm going to fill this bucket. So let me call my wife till her turn the switch on. Yes. Okay, so here we go. That's the water coming out of the sump. That's my new sump pump in the crawl space and the dehumidifier. And this bucket is three gallons. Looks like the bucket's going to overflow. So the bucket's going to overflow. There it goes. So I'm not going to be able to measure it. Probably more like five gallons. Still coming out crazy. A lot of water, huh? And that's with no water leaks under the house. But my plastic, I need to redo my plastic and I need to seal my fence better. Still pumping. That's more than five gallons. Still coming out. Slowing down now. Slowing down. There you go. Probably six or seven gallons. There's no telling what it really was. So that's it. A lot of water from the dehumidifier. Now I need to uh, help prevent that. So I'll make another video once I work on preventing that water. And I'm going to take the dehumidifier out. And then once the dehumidifier is out, then I'm going to do this again to see uh, how much water is in the sump with the dehumidifier out.